shoot. Hands up. Don't 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 shoot. Hi, my name is Sade Lithcott. I'm the CEO of the National Black Theatre. Uh, we just finished opening night of Hands Up. We're in the midst of our 46th season dedicated to the liberation and the transformation of our community. Well, I'm feeling deeply grateful that the National Black Theatre has opened up its doors once again and its heart to the community to share. I'm 21 and I really didn't, never took it really seriously. But like, actually like watching this play, it's like, this is real, like, this is real life, and I gotta take it really seriously. My name is Jahi Kears, member of the ensemble of Hands Up. I wanna invite you to come out and take a part of this piece. It is a piece about uplifting our spirits, remembering who we are, imagining how powerful we can be, and knowing how powerful we are meant to be. Just so hands up, a must-see sponsor a young person today, especially the teens, they must see it. It'll change their lives, get them to think. Everyone should see it because everyone is a part of the conversation. How we're all entangled in the pain of racism from all sides. The show was filled with light, even in the midst of all of it, what it's dealing with is darkness, is that the show was able to bring light into that. Um, to open us up to be ready to heal. Let me tell you, smart is rough, okay? People hate smart people. In fact, smart people hate all the smart people because they don't get to feel superior anymore. You see, smart is power, and the only thing that fake power hates is real power. They want us to pretend like it's not happening. Mm. They want us to look at, at, at Barack Obama, Michael Jordan, and Oprah Winfrey, and believe that everything is okay with us. And because those three made it, we should be able to do it as well. Therefore, racism must be over. What's running through my head are the 10 people that I want to email as soon as this talk back is over to tell them to come see this. Um, three adjectives, I guess it would be timely. Meaningful. Powerful. Timeless. Poignant. Personal. Relevant. My deepest sadness is that this only has a five session run. Six with Astoria and we need to bring as many people as we can. And, and I'm so grateful to MBT for doing this kind of work because it, it, it's been the missing element on the theater scene of New York. The art exhibit that you see called hashtag activism, no justice, no peace, is another wave, another energy level of that same mission of liberating and healing our community. So I hope that you'll come down and see the show or see the exhibit and uh, join us for the rest of our 46th season. What made me most aggravated about the piece is that we had to do it, that we have to do it continuously. New Black Fest already commissioned a similar piece in response to Trayvon Martin. So next year is going to be in response to fill in the blank. That's pretty frustrating.